Hey y'all, so I um, ordered some of the Bottega Duke earrings and the sunglasses. So I'm going to show you the ones that I got. I didn't get the other earrings that everybody's been getting because I don't like like super long or like super chunky earrings. Oh, I don't even know where, except that they were delivered. I don't know where they're at actually. Um, so I got two colors in this. One is silver and then the other one is brown for the sunglasses. So cute. Mm. These are the silver pairs. So cute. Guys, so cute. Wow. Great purchase. I know you miss me. I miss you so much. Hey guys, I am just getting up. It's a new day. It's Sunday, actually. <sighs> I don't have... I was going to say I don't have any work to do today, but I actually do. I have to do... I have to try to get a bunch of my promo stuff done so it's out the way and I can get it approved. Um, but... I'm about to get myself together for the day and Reese together for the day. And then I have a bunch of laundry that I need to put away. I don't really have too much cleaning to do, but I just have a bunch of laundry to put away. So that's like my number one goal today. And maybe getting out the house um, for a little bit, taking like a walk or something. But I don't have too much going on. Um, I do have my Fashion Nova stuff that just got delivered. So I'll probably actually... Today will probably just be about doing promo and doing stuff that I've been needing to do that I have not done. So, Sunday vibes, let's get to it.
She want the tea. She want the tea. I cannot speak. We keep it in street. We keep it in street. I took a loss, but you still don't get beat. You still don't get beat. How much it costs? It never been cheap. It never been. Turn your click up, dog. Turn them off. Turn your bitch up, dog. Hey guys, so refresh your hair with me. Today we are reviewing Timo's new products. So this is going to be their oil. It comes in this packaging, which looks really nice. Everything looks really high quality. And this is a glass bottle. So I loved that. I love a good glass bottle instead of plastic. It helps the environment and is great for the earth. So we love that. And then this is the Iconic Plus hair tool. It is like a brush straightener this was actually really cool and it gets up to 450 degrees it was really easy to get out really simple then we are taking this plastic off and let's get straight into it I'm gonna take my bun down and we're gonna just refresh my hair because you know when you take your bun down you have bumps and it's just all over the place and i had gel in my hair as well so let's refresh our little bob so 
First, I started out with combing my hair all the way through, just making sure I don't have any knots. And then I'm gonna start parting my hair. I'm not doing super small parts, but I'm gonna do, I'm gonna see how well this straightens my hair and then we'll see how I'm gonna part this. I also wet a little piece of my hair in the front that you guys will see at the end of the video and straightened it just to see how straight it would get my hair without blow drying it and it got it so straight I, you don't even need to blow dry your hair and this straightener does such a great job if you don't have one go get one immediately i was really excited to see this i've been seeing this all over my tiktok feed so i was really excited to try this and i was sh so shocked by how well this was and how well it worked and how hot the tool got i ended up having to turn down the heating setting because it got so hot so i love that i love being able to change the setting because sometimes it's too hot and you can't change it and then sometimes it's not hot enough so this was perfect i was pleasantly surprised by this tool as you can see i'm like wow this is amazing but anyway i ended up doing the rest of my hair and you could see later in the video that i ended up turning it down you could actually see smoke a little bit of smoke because it's so hot but this worked really well for my hair i love it this is actually going to be my new straightener i'm going to use this instead of my actual straightener and i want to get the portable one for the car so let me know what you guys think of it because i loved mine and i thought the oil smelled so good the oil smells like perfume so definitely let me know if you have it or if you get it let me know how you like it because i loved mine and i'm so happy to have one but anyway enjoy the rest of the video y'all and we are gonna get to the rest of our vlog Hey y'all, this is realistically my life right now in this point of time. You know, usually I'll be getting up, running errands, cleaning up, <sighs> being a little active. I've never had like a week or like multiple days where I'm just like super lazy in the bed, not like wanting to do anything. I'm not depressed or anything. I'm just like very, I've been so tired lately. I have not been really getting any sleep because Priest will toss and turn. He doesn't like to sleep in his bassinet anymore. So I feel like I've been barely getting any sleep. I have my Sphinx on. I just had to go downstairs to get my groceries because I am over eating out. I have been super lazy. I haven't cooked a thing. So I decided today, it's Friday. 
I don't have any work to do. I'm hosting a haul this week just to give myself a little break from vlogging because I have not done anything this week besides go out to eat so I haven't had anything to vlog for y'all. I'm texting my mom right now because we're planning this. Um, she was asking me the other day what I wanted to do for Christmas and I told her I want to go out of the country. I want to be on a beach in Mexico or I want to go to Jamaica or something like I want to be in warm weather for Christmas. So that's what we're trying to plan right now. I have to go get my passport and me and I have to go get me and Priest passport on Monday. And that's when I'll get my car back too. I get my car back on Monday. If I don't get it back during the day, then I'll just go get um, my passport. Our passport's Tuesday. I'm gonna go to the post office, but I have to have my car so I can um, go get him pictures at like CVS or something. Cause I don't wanna be running around in an Uber. Anyways, like I said, this is me y'all. I have not, I don't, Honestly, I'm going to be honest with y'all, it's 4.30. I have, did I wash my face today? I don't think I've washed my face. I haven't brushed my teeth yet. And then this is literally what I'm wearing. This is just going to be, you know, one of those realistic life vlogs. Because, you know, we all can't be perfect all the time and we all aren't perfect all the time okay so i just look i'm just a freaking bum today but i decided today that i need to cook some stuff so i need to do my dishes i need to wash his bottles because he has no bottles clean i need to wash some dishes and i need to cook something so i chose to make this recipe off of tiktok I'll um, link it for y'all like I always do. It's like this chicken. It's like this easy, easy, easy recipe. If it wasn't easy, I would not be cooking it because, girl, and I do not have any coffee. That's like my main thing. When I wake up feeling like I have no energy, immediately I'll drink a coffee and then boom, we're going. So I don't have any coffee. I've been meaning to go to the grocery store. thought I was going to get my car today, but I'm not. So... I'm so excited to show you guys what my car looks like. It's going to be so freaking fire. But um, anyway, so we're just making do what it soon. So yeah, I ordered some stuff off of Instacart. I ordered two meals. I want to make this chicken lasagna from TikTok that I saw, which probably might not be today. Might be tomorrow or another day. I might do it today. Y'all know how indecisive I am. Once I start doing stuff, I'm like, okay, boom, let's just do all of it. Sometimes I'm like, absolutely not. So we'll see about that. But I'm for sure going to make this chicken recipe in a crock pot. It takes four hours, so I'm trying to hurry up and get this going because it's already 440. So by the time it's done, it should be like 9 o'clock. So, yeah, let's go. I had some of this earlier. When it starts to get a little cold, I am obsessed with hot chocolate. I could eat hot chocolate for lunch, breakfast, dinner. I don't care. Obsessed. Love it today. I need to take my vitamins. What's so today? Today's Friday. So I always take my iron supplement first because when I was pregnant, I used to take all of my supplements at one time. And um, when I went to the doctor, the doctor called me one day. My gynecologist was saying that my iron levels were low. And she was asking me, um, anyway, so they were low because I was taking my iron supplement with the rest of my vitamins and I guess you're not supposed to do that or else, you know, your iron supplement won't do what it's supposed to do if it's mixed with other supplements or vitamins. So I'm about to drink a coffee now um, and then we're just going to get our day or night, I guess we're getting our night started since we kind of just relaxed all day. No one that back calling me splurge. Let me jump right out the curb. Yeah. Make this spur fly like a bird. Spin on the first and the third. Yeah. Solid, I'm keeping my word. Keep my equal, I don't know what you heard. Yeah. Crack up the phone, I swear. Keep me a stick of big purse. Yeah. I don't want that they wrecking my nerves. I'm about to call us a serve. Yeah. Fucking this bitch like a perm. Yeah. Smack from the back of a perm. Yeah. Ice, the bird. Shitting on all you little turds. Can't take that the way you turn. In my own life, we can merge. Yeah. So no hands you can learn. Yeah. Let's see how much you can earn. Yeah. Why me go feel like the worm? Yeah. 
and I ain't smoking no shirt. I'm with it being pee lady. Keep pee, keep pee. I love my bitches, it's pretty. They showing their titties, it's up to the ceiling. I let her run through a million, I rock with a really, let's fuck on a billion. I'ma get down to the gritty, then fuck up the city, the home of the villains. It's a C1, I'm fulfilling. Smoke out the pound and I'm chilling. Trapping, I make me a killer. Look, I got everybody wishing. I hope you play your position. I don't want nobody listening. I see the whole with precision. Give us my only decision. Don't got no one that back calling me splurge. I'm going jump right off the curb. Get this right fly like a bird. Spin on the first and the third. Solid, I'm keeping my word. Tell me my equal, I don't know what you heard. Crack up the phone and I swear. Give me a stick of big purge. and it's dead but I'm gonna go get some breakfast with Priest. I didn't bring Zuri because she just does not know how to act and I feel so bad when I leave her inside and I'm like walking well I've been walking like everywhere around my place because my car's in the shop um, we're getting our rims fixed long story and um, we are getting the car unwrapped so, it's going to be a whole new car, girl. So, I should get it back Friday, but every time they say that, I just, I'm just i just going to expect to get it back by Monday. I'm not even going to expect it Friday. But, yeah, so I'm walking down the street to go get breakfast with Priest. And I've been taking Zuri, like when I've been wanting to get out the house. Because it's been in the shop for like... I want to say like five days now so I haven't had a car but it's been really nice just to like walk down the street and stuff if I had my car I would still probably walk just because it's like it just feels nice outside it's like nice to get out get some fresh air and you know some exercise I am last time y'all I took Zuri this is what happened Zuri does this thing where she likes to bite her leash off and it's so annoying because I've had to get her so many leashes so she didn't have any of her like retractable leashes anymore so I um she had like a regular leash just a regular one to get a retract or anything so regular leash we go to, I don't remember what the place is called, it's not Smash Burger, but it's like a place like that where they have like chicken sandwiches, hot dogs, and they're known for like their cheeseburgers. I don't remember what the place is called, but anyway, there's one by my place. We go. Tell me why Zuri bites off her leash like five different times. Her leash went to being like from, this, from my glasses to like this long probably like arm's length to like this long it was so embarrassing and I had like five like knots on her leash it just was it just looked a mess y'all it was too much going on it was a mess okay so now I'm just like I'm not I can't like both of them is a lot he was acting up she was acting up it was just too much going on and he's at a point right now, like within the last two weeks, he's been at a point where he is just so busy. He just wants to climb everything. He wants to just like, 
he's non-stop like he's no longer chill and it's just a lot for me but anyway i'm starving so i can't wait to get to this place and then i have to go to the bank and then i think that's really all i have plans for today i haven't really vlogged these last few days because i've just had a lot going on like mentally and i haven't really been doing anything especially not having my car and he wants to like stand up he's whining right now because all he wants to do is stand up in his um stroller and it's just it doesn't make any sense i don't know if i am gonna get a drink at brunch or get a coffee i really just don't know i've been not really drinking that much lately and i like really enjoy it but i'm not even gonna lie to y'all like this new chapter priest is in right now has been like really stressing me out and has been a lot for me to handle and i have literally been feeling like i'm gonna lose it this stage of mo motherhood is very challenging for me and I'm just trying to like practice patience and just be as patient as I can with him. But some days are really hard and I need, to, I'm at a point where I like have to force myself to start looking into like a babysitter or a nanny or something because I'm with him from the time he wakes up to the time he goes to sleep. And it is just too much. Like it's starting to like really overwhelm me. And it's just like, it's a lot. But I swear, like, Chris has never been a whiny baby. And now, I don't know if it's because he's, like, teething more or what's going on. I have, like, him teething toys and stuff. But it's, like, when he wakes up, he's whining. When I put, like, if I put him in his walker, which he loves to death, he's whining. If I put him down, he's whining. Like, it's just <laughs> so much. So, I'm ready for this phase to be over with because it... Oh, it's got me in a chokehold, I'm not even gonna lie. And this is what I mean when I said he only wants to stand in his stroller. He likes to try to flip himself over and just stand and do the most. So that's where we're at in life. frappuccino to go or um, they have this frozen frappuccino on the menu so I'm gonna get that to go and then I'm just gonna go home and do everything that I haven't been wanting to do like finish my laundry and just clean up some stuff per usual I've really been like working the past few days and like really trying to get stuff done so now like I don't have anything to do besides like vlog and I don't have anything to vlog right now so, yeah. I'm gonna do like a separate vlog though for like day time and my nighttime skincare routine. It's so simple. You guys have seen it before and before and before and before. But I'm gonna do like an in depth video on it. 
and I'm gonna do my morning routine and my nighttime routine in one video or it's gonna be my afternoon routine I'm not a morning person y'all like I want to start waking up in the morning like 9 a.m. 10 a.m. so badly but I am NOT a morning person and I'm gonna try to like train myself to be but I don't know if that's possible for me I'm just not a morning person I've never been a morning person so I don't know if that's a thing for me I don't know if anybody else struggles with that but like I'm really trying I'm not trying to work on it but I want to try to really work on it so I can get up at like 9 10 a.m every day and just be as productive as possible but it's so hard the like, priest will wake me up naturally at like 8 a.m 9 a.m sometimes but like i will always want to go back to sleep because i feel like i don't ever get like a full night's rest so i feel like i owe myself to like go back to sleep so if you guys have any tips let me know if anybody else struggles with that let me know because it is a lot
Hey guys, I am, we are just getting up. It is probably 11 a.m. I haven't washed my face or brushed my teeth yet. At, I'm probably about to drink a coffee, get a little coffee ready. And then today I installed a wig for the first time, y'all, on TikTok. For TikTok, um, Nadula Hair sent me a wig. So I don't mind Zara, I just had to put her in the cage um, because she keeps chewing, like she'll chew up my clothes and she will chew up Priest clothes. And sometimes I let her sleep out of the cage at night, most of the time, but she doesn't know how to act. So that's why she needs discipline and needs to sleep in her cage because she doesn't know how to act and she'll run the whole house and just be bad. So anyway, Nadula hair sent me awake. So never installed a wig, never put on a wig, nothing. So I did it for TikTok yesterday and then I ended up taking it off because it was giving me a headache and plus I wanna fix the hairline. But I wanna reinstall it today so I'll reinstall it with you guys because I forgot to vlog yesterday because Robbie was trying to walk me through like how to do it. Um, but I am, I wanna like try to reinstall it today and like, you know, do a little look, be cute, get some content maybe like go to lunch or something or dinner or something with priest so yeah we're probably gonna i'm gonna do that and i'll vlog it i'll just do like i'm not gonna do like a full install because that's doing a lot and i'm not about to keep this hair on for like a month probably like a day or two if that my tiktok goes live today so i'll show you guys the tiktok and go watch it go support my tiktok if you haven't already but yeah i'm about to drink some coffee probably eat some oatmeal or something and then we are going to start our day and see what the day has for us so see y'all in a sec yeah my baby is trying to crawl he basically is crawling y'all it's so crazy to me Stinky, come here, baby. Come here, baby. Come here. Come here. He usually will only crawl to like an edge over here or like over here. I don't really like to have him over by the table, but he'll crawl to an edge so he can stand up. But other than that, he's not really interested in crawling too much. Here, hold on, hold on, come here. See, y'all, he has no interest. Come here. He just wants to like, grab my hand so he can stand up. <laughs> Come here, baby. Come here. Good job. Come here. Drama. Drama, boy. <laughs> Look at you. Hey y'all, so I have my cap on, so I'm just going to do this really quick. It's really fast. <sighs> so let's get to it.
I was debating if I should put edges like in the front. Bless you. But I don't know. I don't think I'm going to. Where did your pacifier go? Here. Just don't touch anything, please. There you go. Comfy? And if you are doing anything. I'm a bad little bitch and I'm sick like a bar. Hips, lips, ass in a car. I'll stay motherfucker. Hello, motherfucker. Hello, motherfucker. Okay. So. I'm a bad little bitch and I'm sick like a bar. Hips, lips, ass in a car. I'll stay motherfucker. Hello, motherfucker. Okay, she's the so one that I'm is gonna so go fucking insufferably annoying and never shuts the fuck up and has never bit. been hitting her face in her. I'm gonna go wet this a little bit and then put some mousse on it and we'll see how it goes, okay? You sleepy! Sleepy! Yeah. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna do a whole video on this. Okay, so I put some mousse. I could have wet it a little bit more on this side, but I don't really feel like it. Um, I put some mousse and wet it a little bit, but is this not the most fire hair ever? And I've been saying that, you know, I wanted to switch my hair up, which I'm gonna go get my hair done soon. It's just, I always say that and then I never do it because I'm like, I don't feel like sitting there and actually getting my hair done but i really want to do it so i'm gonna go sometime soon to get like a half up half lap down look so yeah so i need to fix this these i laid some hair down that i don't need to lay down <sighs> okay, this is like all over the place. I cut my lace a little bit like up here and it looks way better than it did yesterday. It looks like more natural so yeah y'all this is our look let me see i'm trying to make sure no i've never did a wig before so i'm like so proud of myself for real uh, So I'm gonna put something on. Robbie's gonna come over and we're gonna go get something to eat downstairs because I still don't have my car and I just don't feel like Ubering anywhere. So um, I don't wanna put some like layers in this but I have no idea how to do that. So I'm like, maybe I shouldn't, but I don't think it's that hard. I don't know, I kinda wanna do it. You just, I feel like all you do is literally that. I don't know guys. I'm going to figure that out if I want to put like some kind of layering in it. I'm going to go brush this back actually. So I'm going to figure out what I want to do with my hair and what I want to wear. And then I will, I'm going to update you guys in a second. Alright guys, so I was going to wear this, but I'm going to change into, I'm going to put that red shirt on because I just love that red shirt to death. Anytime like I feel like weird or like I'm just like whatever about an outfit, I just love that red outfit. I'm not going to wear that outfit. I'm just going to put this shirt on and see 
have it for a This is cute, but it's just not doing it for me. I don't know, I just don't like it today. I feel like if I had my hair out in like a bun, this would be super cute and effortless, but I'm just not feeling it with this hair. This is the red shirt. I might just put the pants on, honestly, and wear that outfit for the 10th time and call it a day because uh, I want to get like a cute picture or something because I was like, let me just take this hair out. But I want to get a cute pic. And I deleted my Instagram, y'all, for a little bit. I deactivated it. Um, just because I'm at a break, I just like get really overwhelmed by social media sometimes. And I just really needed a break so bad. So I deleted it. So I'm going to keep it deleted till I post my next vlog Sunday. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know if I'm going to put the pants on or really what. So I'm probably just going to end up putting the pants on. I don't I kind of want to just I'm always like I always want to wear like comfortable just throw on clothes I never want to dress up so every time I put on pants like this I'm like ugh no unless I'm going to like dinner or like something but during the day I'm just like why I don't know if that's just me but during the day I'm like such like a workout type of girl going to our favorite place just to get something to eat there's like so many places over here but it's kind of like overwhelming so we don't know where else to eat so we're just walking it feels so nice it feels so good and the sun is out it's just great and beautiful i really want to go to this postino's it looks so cute they have a fireplace outside so when it gets like a little well it's already kind of chilly at night so they have like a really cute um it's like a um wine place oh they have like a fireplace over there it looks so cute i want to come here one night they have like wine specials like you can get like two bottles of wine for like twenty dollars and like it's like um uh, bite-sized stuff like they have bruschetta like all the bruschetta is like good but they don't have like real food for real, for real. but it's just so cute yeah i saw that last time we came or we walked this way i never knew i said i saw this last time we walked this way when we went to bar taco i've never seen that before oh, before oh really yeah. they might be oh september 9th so they just opened. Love that. I like it. Yeah. I really want to try this place. It's called The Stone. I heard they have like the $75 pasta. That is like so good. I want to try it really bad, but Robbie never wants to go. So I'm going to have to go here by myself one day. Hot AF. I don't know why I'm so hot.